All right, guys, welcome back. And uh, today on the channel, I just wanted to show you how to spool a beaver dam uh, style tip up with a drill. So it makes it a lot quicker and easier. You don't have to use, uh, you know, you don't have to hand spool it, which takes forever. Um, but with the drill method, it works a lot quicker. So you, this is a brand new beaver dam. Um, I'm running 45 pound braid on it. So what we do is, first you gotta tie it on. I usually like to tie mine towards the front of the uh, towards the front of the reel where you reel up the line and everything. So I just do a standard uh, double knot, triple knot. Sometimes don't really matter. I'll do a double knot on this one. But this method here is so much quicker than uh, hand spooling. Uh, so once you get your knot tied. You gotta take your drill and you attach it to the top here, um, whatever you want to call this, where the trigger is. This works a lot better with two people as well, because one person can operate the drill and one person can uh, spool the line. But I'm gonna have my wife run the drill for me. So once you get it up, it'll look something like this. Um, you guys, I guess you can actually keep it on the table just like that, and that'll be fine. I usually run it so the drill battery is flat on the table, but that'll work fine. <laughs> so once you got your drill tightened up, I gotta un to unspool this a little bit from tightening the drill, but. Um, so you have to put the drill on reverse and then basically all you do is you start spinning it or you start running the drill. Go ahead. Start, so you start off slow usually and you get this work your spool around. Let's go get this spool out of the way. And then you just start working across the reel. Now you can start picking up speed. You do want to be careful how tightly you hold the line though, because it could touch you. Go a little bit more. Okay. That'll probably be enough right there. So then all you gotta do is just cut it. Then you take your drill off. Um, basically, you just put it on reverse. Or, uh, sorry, reverse, and you just hold it till it's loose, and you slide your tip up out and then you got a perfectly spooled tip up I mean, you can't really spool that much better but <clears throat> that'll be uh that'll be about it for this video i just wanted to show you that quick and easy way to spool a tip up way better than the traditional way if you have a drill uh, but most people that ice fish nowadays do have an electric drill because they all use um electric augers but if you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and uh, we'll catch you on the next one.